Mauricio Pochettino and Paris Saint-Germain seem to be heading for a miserable divorce, with the League One leaders suffering a fresh humiliation after their Champions League exit to Real Madrid. Only this time it was Monaco who caused them embarrassment by winning 3-0. Make no mistake, it has hardly been a classic season for Monaco, with rumors of discontent at Stade Louis II easy to seek out, yet they were able to destroy the French champions-elect on Sunday afternoon. It was a result that may well have more bearing on the future of Pochettino and some of his players than the eventual destination of the French championship. Lionel Messi and Neymar were both whistled and booed in their most recent home match, but the club's away form is becoming a real concern too, with the team having lost their last four matches away from the Parc de Princes. Wiesem Ben Yedder got the hosts off to a firing start, scoring on the 25th minute after a quite exquisite piece of team football. Yusuf Fofana provided the former Sevilla forward with the assist, and he duly finished with a quite outrageous backheel strike. As so often in matches this term, PSG players tend to drift along, not really leaving their mark, and the exact same thing occurred on Sunday afternoon, even if the visitors had vastly more possession. It may have taken until the 68th minute for Monaco to double their advantage, but they did so through Kevin Volland, who was left spectacularly unmarked inside the PSG penalty area, and he had all the time in the world to put the ball into the bottom corner. The dreadful afternoon was compounded eight minutes from time when Presnel Kempembe gave away a penalty for a rash tackle, leaving the referee with a very easy option. Ben Yedder stepped up to take the spot kick, and he converted with ease, leaving PSG facing one of their biggest humiliations since the QSI took over the club.